What's up everybody? Today I'm going to do a review on the Joytech Cubreal Wood. It's a dual 18650 mod. Stainless, well it claims it was stainless steel, but hell look at it. I've used it so much, just and rubbed it down to a brass, maybe copper coating. So it's stainless steel plated, which is very disappointing to me. Very heavy weight. It's solid as a rock. Um, let's give it a tote. It's excellent. If you can see on the screen, it's got everything you need. It'll show you your uh, your wattage, which will go from on down and like probably 3.3 .3 all the way up to 150. You can get that firmware upgraded to this slot here. Um, it shows you both batteries, how much charge is left in both batteries. It'll show you your coil ohms. It'll show you your voltage that you're vaping at also. And you can switch this from variable wattage to variable um, voltage. Alright, now let's pop out the batteries. It has a little lid that you just do that right there and pow. Your batteries, some, sometimes it's kind of hard to get out. That's one of my nitpicks about this thing and the fact that it's, it's the, the uh, chrome or so-called stainless steel is coming off. Um, well, the other battery's kind of stuck. I have to, you have to kind of like when you put your thing, take your thing open, kind of like beat it on your arm to get the batteries to fall out. Um, all around solid mod is you take off your tank, which is the Halo reactor tank, by the way. I've done a review on just before this one, and uh, it's got your spring loaded. 510 gold plated connection and uh it's just i've enjoyed it for quite a long time i had it for a year now ever since it came out and it still held up strong except for the the fit and finish it's got a lot of patina on it which shouldn't have done it because i take very very good care of my mods and everything but if you want something that's really heavy kind of small and holds two 18650 batteries then, I mean, I, I would go for it if you don't care about how the uh, stainless steel slash chrome wears off. It's all around just solid mod. I mean, you drop this sucker, it's not gonna, it's not gonna mess anything up. You can sling it across the room and you can probably still vape on it just fine. That's it for now. Um, keep vaping and uh, watch out for more reviews. Please like subscribe and comment i love to answer everybody's comments y'all have a great day